Hey. Hey yo everyone, Blakester here. I'm back. So yeah, it has been over a week since my last video and to put it simply put as to why I've been gone for so long, I got a job. So yeah, and this job has pretty much taken up a good portion of my time and I wasn't able to make any videos as frequently as I used to. And I'd like to use this opportunity to say that now that I have this job, there's not going to be videos uploaded as frequently as they once were on my channel. So if you want to be up to date for whatever new video I put out, make sure to hit that subscribe button. But we're here for a video right now and... It is the return of the queen of K-pop herself, Boa, with her new song called Camo. Man, it has been a minute, Boa. Boa was actually the second K-pop artist I actually found out about after SNSD. Yeah, I actually found out about her through her music video for Hurricane Venus, jammed to this day. And Boa just has such great songs out, and she has such a wonderful persona as an artist. And the fact that she's pretty much one of the longest lasting artists in SM Entertainment, like, she's just an absolute legend, not only in SM, but in K-pop in general, and to be honest, I kind of hope she becomes president of SM one day. But yeah, I've heard several things about this song. I heard that it has a bit of a futuristic vibe, and I'm down for that. So yeah, without further ado, let's check this out. Three, two, one, hit the playback. Oh. Oh snap. Oh. Uh. Oh, steam. Boa. Can that one. Oh, wait. Oh, she's going to be rhythmic dancing. Oh, it's a whole bunch of backup dancers. Okay. I thought say she's going to rhythmic dance with a partner like she did. Oh. And only one. Ooh. Just the aura right there, ladies and gentlemen. That is Boa. And she has such a distinctive voice, too. Like, all them LED lights, some of that patterns on there. And you watch America's Got Talent. That's what's reminding me of. If you know what I'm talking about. Oh, snap. Oh, that's... <laughs> that was kind of creepy. Oh, break it down. Oh, yeah. Seriously. But always has the coolest, like, outfits whenever she has in these videos, too, like... Ooh! Okay. Like, like, look at that! Just... Casually wearing a workout outfit and, like, with the jacket on and that's a dance outfit, and, like... Seriously, she rarely ever wears, like, dresses or skirts. Like, when she does her videos. It is futuristic, like, all these visual effects, and, and the song is called Camo, so I guess this has something to do with it. Oh, I guess so. Sorry about this computer making noise. Again. Come on. That set though, I wonder if that's an actual real place or is that just CG'd in? Oh, here we go. Woo! Boa is just. She went from this 13 year old cute little dancer to this 30 year old hot mama. Sorry. <laughs> Well, I'm just saying, like, 
you know what I mean. That death storm though. Look at us in that move, like Boa and Rain are just two artists, solo artists I just absolutely respect because of what they did to the K-pop industry. Like And they just always produce such good songs too. Boa can't she disappeared. Was she like a holograph all this time? SM and your conspiracy theories. No, I don't want no cosmetics! Alright, well, Boa Camo. Well, first of all, that video, though. <sighs> like, I liked the fact that the video had all these kinds of LED effects in there, which that seems to be a big trend in K-pop nowadays, having, like, all these LED effects, whether it be on the sets or, you know, just in the dancing room and on the dancers themselves in general, which I think is really cool, and they definitely pulled this off really, really well in this video. Like, the title of the song was Camo, because, you know, camouflage, and they definitely put its symbolism to good use. And I just love the CGI in that video. Like, that was some great CGI and visual effects, too, which it seems like SM always likes to do this for their senior artists. Which I really applaud them for that because, you know, SM gets a lot of crap for, like, not treating their senior artists or their very well-established artists, like, the best after, you know, they're, like, past their prime. But the fact that they acknowledge them by giving them budget videos like this with the CGI and the LEDs and the sets, those marvelous sets, I mean, you gotta give them an A-plus for effort. I still give them enough for promotion, but uh, it's SN. And then the song, pretty much your typical Boa song. It was upbeat, it was dance heavy, it pretty much made you want to bust a move here and there, especially in the chorus. And yeah, it was just your typical Boa song. And I like me some Boa. And then finally, the dancing. I don't think I need to explain. <laughs> so yeah, another quality song and video by the Queen of K-Pop herself. Good on you, Boa. So anyways, that's my opinion. What are your guys' opinions? Put it down in the comments down below. This is Blakester, and you're watching Ayo Blakester. So if you like this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more, because I make new videos every week. And make sure to follow me on Twitter if you want to. Link in the description. So until next time, peace out, Blake Scouts. Three. <clears throat>